what are the health risks that guys should consider if they're thinking about going on TRT? Well, it depends the context in which they enter into that. Because again, if you don't actually need it and you get on it, you could be making yourself less healthy if you're already perfectly functioning top tier. But if you don't, if you do need it and you're clinically deficient, and again, not not medical advice, but in general, you're going to be more prone to things like cardiovascular disease, neurodegeneration, et cetera. So it's kind of like, if you actually clinically need something to then say, what is the downside to TRT? It's like, what is the downside of not being on TRT at that point, potentially? That's the kind of how I would frame it for the actual clinical utility of it in a real deficient setting. It's kind of like, what could you be staving off by using it in a responsible way? 